what's up guys it's Emily and welcome back to my channel today it's Friday the 13th of July I have quite a lot to say to you guys but first I'm going to else to pick up some merchandise and then I'll get back to you with the update hello Alright, so I'm back and I have quite a lot to say to you guys. I do share photos and videos on Facebook and Instagram regularly, but there is a lot of stuff that I haven't shared on YouTube yet. In my previous vlog, I'm pretty sure it was at the ending, I told you guys very quickly that I have my own custom guitar. I am officially endorsed by Radix Guitars from Indonesia. They sent me two bodies of seven string guitars. They were unfinished so that we could finish them up at my dad's guitar workshop. I will show you the guitar right now. So this is my guitar. It turned out so beautiful and it also plays good. And that's the most important part, of course. I filmed the whole process of the guitar arriving, the building, the sanding, spray painting, setting up and everything. I will make a separate making of video about this guitar. And then I will explain a bit more and talk about it in depth. So that's big news number one. The second thing is that I got a new logo. You might have seen it already in the intro of my previous vlog. So this is the logo that I got made for me. I'm really happy with how it turned out. Some cool stuff to show you is that I ordered stickers with my logo. I have two different kinds. This is the one to promote my social media, my YouTube channel and stuff. And this is the other one that has the logo of the guitar brands that I work with. So now that I have a new logo, I also ordered my very own guitar picks. I chose four white picks with the logo in black and on the other side is my face. I thought that was really funny. I wanted my own guitar picks for quite some time already, but I wanted good ones that I could use to play with and not just the cheap ones for promotion only. So I found a company that makes them and I saw that they work together with a lot of big bands. So I thought it would be a good choice to go for them and it was because they are great quality. I went for 1.14 millimeters and that's what I always use. Um, this is not sponsored by the way, but I'm just sharing my thoughts and I thought that there might be some guitar players watching who might be interested in this. Then this is the third announcement and this is a big one. By now you probably know that I am the new guitarist of death metal band Sisters of Suffocation and I am proud to announce that we have signed a record deal with the mighty Napalm Records. At the moment we are working on a new album which will be released at the beginning of 2019. So that's very, very exciting. I hope you are excited as well. All right, so that's a lot of stuff that I haven't shared on my channel before. Um, I didn't want you guys to miss out. I know that not everyone follows me on Facebook and Instagram as well. This month I have so many exciting stuff coming up that I want to share. I'm planning on vlogging again. I'm going to visit a festival tomorrow. I have band rehearsal next week. My first shows are coming up and we are leaving for metal days. So a lot of exciting stuff is happening. But I wanted to give you guys this update first so you know what's going on. The reason why I'm vlogging today is because today is an exciting day as well. Radix Guitars is the brand that I told you about. They just launched a new range of guitars called Hevel Guitars. They call it the dark side of Radix Guitars. It's still a part from Radix, but it's a little bit more focused on metal guitarists. The Hevel Guitars will be sold exclusively in Europe by my dad's company Q Guitars. And today is the presentation party. Toyen, the owner of Radix and Havoc, came over from Indonesia with his wife so they can be at this presentation party today in the Netherlands. So that's really cool. I thought that would be 
a cool thing to vlog I'm going to show him my guitar because he hasn't seen the finished result in person yet he only saw a photo on Facebook so that's very exciting so this was a lot of information I hope you can still follow everything but if I wasn't very clear on something feel free to ask it in the comments down below and I will answer so yeah that's everything that I wanted to say in this update for now let's move on to the vlog It's evening already and I'm going to bed. I hope you liked this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe so you keep up to date on everything that I do on this channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with a new vlog at Dynamo Metal Fest tomorrow. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!